All right, so today we are going to be talking about the Garment Instinct, which I just bought. As some of you know, I guess there's the name right there. As some of you know, um, I was rocking the Galaxy Watch, which I hated. I absolutely hated. It might be because I didn't have a Samsung phone or something, but it took forever to load into apps. took forever to get like your interval, your workout, and like the GPS was off, the heart rate was off. And I usually mostly use it for activity, and for some reason, it just was too complex for me. So I did it. I went, got a, a Garmin Instinct, used it today for uh, intervals, runs, and walk. Now, I got to tell you guys, the GPS is like almost like, I just use the regular GPS. You can choose if you want to use the GPS with the Galileo, I think it's called, and then another one. Um, I just use the regular GPS. But I gotta tell you, even just going into the app, it's way more simplistic. Like it tells you your activities burned for calories. You can adjust like how you want to see your stuff on there. Um, and the watch faces. I mean, you can watch all that in a different video. But I gotta say, it's pretty dead on accurate. And the one thing I love about it is it's it's a tough watch. It's super comfortable. That was the one thing I was worried because like I've had Casio watches. Actually, I was just wearing my Casio watch. Um, before this came in and I just I didn't like the feel but something about like this rubber texture it's just super comfortable and these watches are supposed to last like 14 days on the battery charge uh, but most people said 10 based on their workouts and stuff so I gotta say uh, so far really love it it's been super pretty simple once you figure out like what's back what's forward because you have to mostly customize everything on there um, but let's kind of get into it a little bit. So let me unplug it. So it decided to do an update on me before I could show you guys. I was literally about to show you. Sorry, dude. You like my Texas hat? Anyways, um, another reason why I bought this too is for when I go out in the field and military stuff. Before I would take my Apple Watch and just charge it out there. Galaxy Watch, I was like, I'm not taking this garbage. Um, and the fact, like, it was just super complicated. But because of the fact this is supposed to be meant for mostly military members that has your GPS on there, it'll tell you your coordinates within like seconds. Uh, and then you can track like where you want to navigate to. Um, just checking the, it's uh, update. Um, navigate to, you can set like my location, save this location for home and you can change the name and stuff like that. The workouts you can, you can kind of customize as well. Like you're running what kind of GPS you want background and that. So this is what it looks like. Um, this is how I got the watch face set up. It kind of see it. Let me change the camera. All right, so this is what it looks like. Um, this is the front. This is you can change all the watch faces. You can watch other people's videos here. If you just push GPS, you can change all this based on like what you use and like how you want it to look and all that. So run, strength training. Um, you can set that all up. And if you hold down GPS, it'll show you your location literally like seconds. I'm just gonna go back because I don't want you guys to see my location. But you can turn, obviously you can turn on this light, stuff like that, but, and then you have like these little things you can show. But I love this because it is like super water resistant, super rugged, very comfortable uh, wearing, super light. And I was skeptical at first about how light it was because um, a lot of people are like, oh, it's super light, it's super good. and. Um, gotta be good. I heard one thing though is the heart rate isn't as accurate. Uh, I think when they said when you go to do your workouts, it'll start to be more accurate, but still not as accurate as if you were to wear a chest strap, which really for burning calories, heart rate doesn't matter. It's more when you're trying to get your cardio up, which for me, I am. Um, I was doing intervals and like my fastest speed was like a seven minute mile average probably. And I was like, oh, I like dying. And when most people can, like, there's a lot of people out there who can run you know, a six minute mile for a mile. Instead, my pace was like for 0.1. And I'm just like, ah, dog in it. So something I got to work on. That's kind of why I bought it too. Accurate GPS, accurate. It, but it's super simple. And the fact that you can navigate, like it'll tell you, like let's say I want to set coordinates where I want to go. It'll tell me how to get there, how far, you know, bar meter. And you can have it like set up warning alerts. Uh, but it'll give you text messages. If you have an Android phone, you can like send specific messages back. You can customize and stuff. Kind of like the Galaxy watches. Um, and the battery life on here, like I said, 10 days. Uh, 14 days it says, but most people with activities, like 10 days. Uh, in GPS mode, it's four, or 16 hours. And then in the uh, power saving GPS mode, it's 40 hours. So if you're going like kayaking, canoeing, you can, you know, 
like I guess put that out there but um, I love it I love it so far way better like the first time I got the Galaxy I was like oh, I don't really like this but instantly when I got this I'm like I love this so um, a little biased but this is the first day review I'm gonna give you guys like a week later um, all the things like that but I would check out other people's videos if you're trying to see the customization on it I'm just leaving you guys my thoughts on it how much I love all right guys thanks for watching and I hope this helped you uh, kind of make a decision or choice or whatever you're trying to get fitness i like it too one if you're going for like a fitbit price range like the 200 range i would go with that the only problem is you can't add your music to it um but you can control your music with it but you can't add music to it and um you can't do like that watch pay which i've never done anyways not even with my phone so um but i like it especially when i'm running a lot of times i like to just think to myself anyways um instead of listening to music but all right guys thanks for watching and stay tuned and i would